Today, we're going to heal and balance your chakras in a meditation. So make yourself very comfortable. Close your eyes, all of you. And at the moment you close your eyes, make an intent to feel your most expanded, beautiful, loving, blissful self. Keep your eyes closed throughout the meditation. I explain this why the mind does not have the outer distractions to focus on and thus turns inward automatically and usually you fall asleep. But in meditation you enter the alpha state. Do not worry if day-to-day -day thoughts are coming. Let them pass. Let them pass by like clouds drifting. Just feel a fountain rise within you. See your energies expand. Feel a brightening in the room. And in spite of all this, feel still, at rest. Nothing happening, and yet all around you, within you, you are on. You are joy. You are bliss. You are like a fountain pouring out your own sweetness. So now focus on your first chakra, the root chakra, the Maladhara. See it pulsing red. See it a pearly white. All of you see a red pulsating, beautiful glowing red. Understand that this is where you feel joy and fulfillment. Become aware consciously this is the chakra of tangible abundance. Also become aware this is where you feel safe, secure, protected. And from here, amid strands of your energy, down into earth, Deeper, 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 deeper. Feel earth embrace you, gather you. Feel yourself being secured and planted. Feel yourself going through the many layers of red, fresh soil to be gathered into the ultimate mother's arms. And as you keep going down, you will plant this self, your current self, your current energies into a layer of pure crystalline rock. This is purely symbolic because where you plant yourself is source, which is within each of us. Therefore, the very core is in earth. For whenever you go deeper, you go higher. They are the same. Plant yourself here firmly. And even as you do this today, view earth's energy rise through the soil and come up into you all around. Gaia Earth is with us today. Her energies are present. Those of you who can tune in, connect to these energies of Earth, Gaia. Solid, safe, secure, protection, nurturing, abundance, joy, fulfillment of the material plane. She actually sits in front of you, each of you, now. Earth Gaia Ma. She has come in a beautifully adorned form and she asks you to look into her eyes and see in her reflection all that you are. Joy, fulfillment, Abundance, bliss 
of the material plane. Just imagine this right now. And now slowly, slowly, slowly take your focus up to the second chakra, the sacral, the hara, two fingers below your navel. For all newcomers, it's a good place to place your hands on this. And again, view two strands from here, emit on either side of you, and see you go out into the air, into the realms. See them stretch, 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 allow them to stop where they automatically stop. Do not stretch more than they want to stop, and whenever they stop of their own accord, Hook it into that realm, that dimension, trusting that it has stopped at that point from where you most require the energies for this chakra. And even as you do that, receive from this chakra. Just take a moment for this to happen. From where you have planted your energy hooks, receive into this chakra all the wonders of the sacral chakra. Receive wisdom, information, knowledge and knowing. That is why it is known as the gut. So receive all the knowledge, all the information that you need to transform into your wisdom. into your knowing, into your gut knowing, at this chakra. Understand that all the answers are within you to be found here. Therefore receive all that you need answers for. Understand that this is the chakra where you hold all your fears and therefore, by this very act of receiving clarity, answers, awareness, knowledge, light, automatically there is no space for fears. See this chakra releasing fears. See it crumble. See it open. And see your fears being released shattering apart. Understand how this is done. You have made no effort to focus on your fears. You only have focused on wisdom, awareness, light, and automatically your fears are releasing. Release them, release them, all your self-doubts, self-negations, the empty chatter, and yet only focus on filling and filling and filling with pure yellow golden light. And now observe this chakra as a pure yellow lotus or circle. This is also the chakra of balance, but what you will call your health, vitality, all of you who are suffering from any physical ailment, receive into this chakra whatever is required to heal thyself. This is also the chakra beloved's for beauty. View your beauty at this chakra. View your most beautiful, glorious, radiant self and feel desirable. Feel sensuous, view your glory, see it, taste it, feel it, touch it. Revel in your beauty at this chakra and you will find others reflect this in your eyes. Feel energy enter you 
at this chakra. See it fill your body, your blood, your organs. See it pour out of your crown chakra into a pool around your feet, again entering you and coming up to your second chakra so that this cycle is forever on. And even as you have done this again, become aware of your energy field, your aura, and watch it glow and glow. Understand that the flow is always on. The energies are going up your spi spinal, out of your crown, flowing out like a fountain, pooling around you and entering again your maladhara and your sacral. Feel the expansion of yourself. Feel your joyful presence, your abundant self, your beautiful self. Feel the balance. Feel the beauty. Feel the inner wisdom. And feel your power. And now we're going to slowly focus on your heart chakra. Just gently become aware of this heart chakra. Do not try and view what kind of strands lead. Do not direct. Your minds cannot reach where your heart holds. You will merely view the energies reflect on your heart chakra much like sunshine would reflect on your body when you lay in the sun. Conjure yourself sitting in a beautiful space and the sun shining on your heart chakra. Focus here on what you call pure love. Make an intent that at this chakra you will receive the highest, deepest, purest feelings that we have chosen to experience through creation itself. Allow yourself to be filled here with unconditional love, non-judgment, acceptance, gratitude, thankfulness and forgiveness. Let us fill your heart till your heart bursts open with the sweet, sweet sweetness of this love. And even as it fills your body, your blood, your organs, your cells, even as it, go, as it goes up the spinal canal and out of your crown, pouring around you, you feel love for self. Understand that each and every aspect that you have experienced till now, each and every quality that you have explored is what you are in the now. In this knowing, at this chakra, focus on loving this gorgeous, glorious, strong, empowered, balanced, wise, healthy, vibrant, beautiful self. Fall in love with yourselves, beloveds. Fall in love with yourselves, beloveds, at this chakra. In front of each of you is a physical duplicate of each of you in the now. In the now current view, a physical duplicate is sitting across each of you. Look at her. For him. Fall in love with her or him. See the beauty. Taste her. Give her a kiss on the cheek. Smell her fragrance. Her hands, her palms, her shoulders. 
see her quiver even as you do. Blend herself, fall in love with self. Employ all your senses. Let this not be spiritual, fall in love with yourself. View your beauty, taste yourself, touch yourself, smell yourself, hear yourself sing, fall in love with self, and fill yourself up with self-love. And even as you do this, as you are filled with self-love, watch the duplicate disappear and merge and blend. There is no other outside you. Watch your pink heart chakra and see it like a beautiful pink lotus. Pink rose, pink orb. See this pink in your blood, in your body, in your organs, in your cell. See it emanate outside of you. See yourself sitting in a pink ball. See the pink ball sitting in a pink room. See the pink room si sitting in a pink world and see the pink world, one with creation. Try and keep your attention, newcomers. It is a little long, but it will serve you well. Now slowly watch your personal energy field. It is glowing and glowing and glowing. Feel this beautiful love feels like. Focus on your throat chakra. Again from your throat chakra. Six strands go out. Six strands, three what you would call upwards and three what you would call downwards, like a star formation. Do not worry if you cannot see these. Just know and allow them to stretch. Stretch, 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 and stop, stop, stop whenever they it is comfortable to hook on and receive from there from six different realms, six different dimensions, all that you require at your throat. Understand this is the chakra from where you experience your individuality, who you are, how you are special, what's your purpose to be, what is your unique expression of the God, of the God Self. At this chakra we want you to become aware that you are a unique expression of the whole. God chooses to explore and experience and express itself through you. Claim this, revel in this, and enjoy being who you are at the throat chakra. Understand that you contribute to making the whole you as you are now. This is also the chakra where you hold jealousies, comparisons with others. So even as you feel with your unique self, release all comparisons. Release jealousy, release, release, release. Those of you who wish to employ a hobby, who wish to find a passion and activity, focus on this chakra and make an intent 
that that task will come to you, that passion, that expression that only you can do and which in which you will find joy and fulfillment and abundance and strength, beauty and balance. Make that intent of this throat chakra and see the throat chakra as a blue, as a turquoise blue and watch your aura, your energy field glow and glow and glow. And now slowly take your focus up to the third eye where you would wear a bindi. View a diamond over here. View a diamond in your third eye and allow this diamond to reflect from wherever in the universe, whatever is required for your third eye. This is the chakra of pure intellect, pure seeing, not knowing, but seeing what you know. All of you who wish for intuitive psychic powers, focus on that intent in the diamond. Allow it to receive what it requires. This is the chakra of being the seer. Not only who sees mystical apparitions, but the seer who may see whatever is required by you in your day-to-day -day life so that you may get day-to-day -day clarity. Make this intent at the chakra and understand this is a very, very important chakra because what you see within this diamond, whatever image, whatever picture you see of self is what you will meet on the outside as yourself, as your people, as your friends, as your loves. So today in this diamond, having worked on all your glorious aspects and selves, See the highest potential of who you are. What would you like to be? Choose to be. See yourself secure, safe, strong, abundant, joyful, fulfilled, healthy, empowered, and successful. See yourself with complete charity, clarity of life, Heart, and allow this fountain to pour out again all around you and into you. And for the last time as your heightened energies enter you, focus on the red mandala, focus on the yellow sapphire on the gold solar plexus, on the pink heart, the blue throat and the deep blue indigo third eye. And let all this pour out of your crown all around you. Know that you are most expanded self, your most divine self. Your own divinity pours out of you, around you, permeates you, emanates from you, and emanates into your homes, your careers, in this thankful be thankful for this experience that you have chosen through this life. And so it is, and so it is, and so it is. So before you open your eyes, we'll make one last intent. We will ask that each chakra to fill whatever is required in the now and to thereby remove what is not required comfortably in the now and that each chakra is optimally balanced for a joyous journey in the now. I shall repeat at each chakra you add and fill what is required and cleanse and remove what is not required and you balance out the chakra, all chakras. 
So feel your divine self. Allow your divinity to fill you, pour in you, emanate you. And even as you open your eyes, be consciously aware that this new you will attract to you when in keeping with the person that you are. Teachers, guides, students, those who will help you, those whom you can help, those experiences, those incidences, and those events, those homes that are fully aligned with the new energy field. Just be in a state of receiving. Just receiving. Just feel yourself as something that there are no words. See your most joyous, fulfilled self. See this joyous, fulfilled self, head thrown back in joy that you have no words for. And keep that image. Know that all will be balanced as you require. So open your eyes and maintain this love that you are sending. Think of whoever you can think of that may need some healing in this moment. And just send this love and joy to whoever you can think of. Just take this moment in silence. And peace in your heart be yours. And I thank you for being on this healing of the chakras today. Journey with me. I am Rosary Moore. Namaste.